Hashem. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Raka Kodash. Double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone who teach and rule well. And Shalom to the sincere Akim, spread his truth and sincerity. Shalom. So, in this video, I want to talk about how the, the right hand of the Most High shall not spare the sinners. And in this video, the right hand that shall not spare the sinners is referring to the elect of Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai. Those that eventually, you know, shall take vengeance, man, upon the enemies of Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai and upon those that troubled, you know, our people, man. You know, all the way from the, the whole nation as a collective but also those that troubled us in our lifetimes, man. So this is uh, 2nd Ezra chapter 15 and verse 21 and it says, Like as they do yet this day unto my chosen, so will I do also and recompense in their bosom, thus said the Lord Yahweh power. And if you look at what all these other nations have done to our people, they've done many atrocities, man. And you know, Esau Edom, the so-called white man upon the earth, he has gone further than any nation upon this earth concerning what has been done to our people, man, by his hand. <coughs> but all these other nations that, you know, have done, you know, less of atrocities, they should not, you know, escape, you know, the, the judgment that is to come, man, you know, that is going to be, you know, recompensed onto them, and it's going to be, you know, basically uh, um, rewarded unto them, man. you know, because don't think, you know, and this is speaking about Esau, Edom, the so called white men upon the earth, don't think that, you know, for everything that you have done to our people, you know, during the time of slavery, you know, during the time of segregation, you know, during, you know, uh, 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 what happened during those Jim Crow laws and what is still going on up upon the earth up until this day and age towards our people, you know, being shut up, you know, being mistreated, being spit on, you know, being uh, uh, seen as inferior, being treated as less of a, as less than a human, man. Don't think that for, where, for, for, for whatever you have done towards our people, you know, starting off with the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you know, and then you also have those that look like the heathen nations, but me, for instance, you know, I, I, I never, I never uh, 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 suffer the same type of racism, you know, as uh, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. Because I don't look like, you know, your typical Israelite. But, in the spirit, you know, these people know what's up concerning, you know, those that look like the heathen nations, man. They're still being treated differently because, you know, even though we look like the heathen nations, we cannot escape the curses, man. You know, we might suffer the, the racism, you know, less than the other nations because, you know, right now at my work, I suffer some sort of racism, man, because I'm so-called Dutch, right? But I work for Turkish people, I work for Amalekites, you know, and they despise Dutch people, you know, they despise, you know, Jake, they despise, you know, any anyone else but themselves, man, and even within their own people. You know, there's, there's hatred towards one another, man, because of the curses, you know, backfiring upon them, you know, coming upon them. But for everything they have done towards, you know, our people, whether it's, you know, great or small, the heathens shall not escape the judgment and the recompense that is set for them, you know. Everything is going to be paid back, man. You know, all the way, you know, back to the time, you know, from King David all the way up to now, man. Everything that they have done towards our people, you know, through the Spirit. So this is uh, Second Ezra chapter 15 and verse 22. My right hand shall not spare the sinners, and my sword shall not seize over them that shed innocent blood upon the earth. The right hand of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shaz referring to the elect. They're going to be the ones, you know, together with Yahweh Shai and the angels, 
you know, to bring that recompense upon the earth. So when Yahweh Shai comes back, the elect shall be beamed up, and those that are already with Yahweh Shai, you know, they're going to be, you know, also, you know, coming back to bring forth uh, vengeance, man. They're going to bring that, that recompense, man. They're going to, everybody's going to be changed by then. And then we're going to have those spiritual powers by which no Eden, and especially Esau Edom, is not able to come up against us and have any chance to stand against us, man. Because we're going to be fueled up, you know, by the by the spirit and power of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. You know? And it says, shall not spare the sinners. Shall not spare the sinners, man. Those that transgress the law, the commandments of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. This includes our own people, man. This includes our own people that are not keeping the ways of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. You see? This includes them. So this also is talking about the heathens, man. That don't know about the ways of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. <coughs> and the number one nation upon the earth, you know, upon which that sword shall not cease, is Esau, man, because they love to shed innocent blood, man. They love to shed that, man. But yeah, you know, concerning these other nations, there are also other nations, you know, out there that do these things, man. So no nation is gonna escape the judgment of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai, man. It's going to be executed in righteousness, man. You know, the, 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 the as it also says in, 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 in Isaiah, man, the, um, the judgment shall overflow with righteousness. You know? Why? Because everything that the Heavenly Father does is righteous, man. Even the, 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 the judgment that's being, you know, put forth upon the earth. It's all done in righteousness, man. Because it's only a righteous thing, you know, to, to have a, a judgment for a, 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 you know, a sad breaking of the law or, or, or a sad, uh, uh, how do you say that? When people have done certain things, man, that are just uh, unrighteous, man. So righteousness has to proceed. This is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 5, verse 17. He shall take to him his jealousy for complete armor. And make the creature his weapon for the revenge of his enemies, man. And the creatures referring to the elect of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, they're gonna be changed, you know, into weapons, man. Into weapons for the revenge of the enemies of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. You know, and what they, what they have done, you know, to the you know, to the chosen of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, man, you know, starting off with the whole nation and you know, uh, then, you know, to the elect, you know, they, they're gonna be uh how you say that? They're going to be a judge for, man. They're going to be judged for their ways, for what they have done to our people, man. You know? So, yeah, man. Hey, the time is going to come that the elect is going to power up. And we're going to put forth judgment upon the earth, man. We're going to take the righteous, you know, the righteousness of the Heavenly Father. And we're going to execute judgment against the unrighteous, man. You know, and a righteous kingdom shall be established, you know, under the government of Yashar Allah, which is the nation of Israel. You know, in this day and age, those that are so good Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, but also those that were scattered among the heathen nations, looking like the heathen nations. But his lineage does go back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, according to their father's seed line. Now, they are the children of Israel. You know, it's spoken about in the scriptures. And uh, the time is going to come that we're going to take the kingdom, man. Eh? gonna take the kingdom and then the earth you know shall overflow in righteousness as it is supposed to man the earth is gonna rejoice the animals gonna rejoice even the people gonna rejoice because righteousness is executed upon the earth so with that I hope and pray that this video was edifying and with that I want to give all praise honor and glory unto Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai Bahasham Rakakudash double honors to the elder apostles of great millstone who teach and rule well and shalom to the sincere Akiyam's branch truth and sincerity. Shalom.